Each year, we select one outstanding graduating student to address the class. This year, I'm pleased to introduce you to today's Klein College speaker, Adam Cronali. Adam is graduating today with a degree in journalism. At Temple, he positioned himself to use his own words, to be the best Swiss army knife he could be in the world of sports journalism. While a student here, Adam joined TUTV's Al Sports Update as a volunteer and was a reporter for their Emmy-nominated production of A Fran Farewell, special on basketball coach Fran Dunphy. Since that time, he's also been the anchor for three different programs. He's a play-by-play -play broadcaster on WHI, IP radio, calling games for both Temple football and basketball. And as I learned today, he is a bat boy for the Philadelphia Phillies. Outside of Temple, he interned with AlScoop.com as a writer and with NBC Sports Philadelphia and radio station WMGK. Clearly, he became a Swiss Army knife and is well on his way to a dream job. As you'll soon learn, though none of this success came easy as Adam overcame not only the obstacles presented by COVID, but by his own personal health challenges. Please join me in welcoming Adam Krugnall. Thank you, President Engler, Provost Epps, Trustee Katz, Dean Boardman, Janet Klein, faculty, staff, and students. Fellow graduates, have you ever just sat somewhere for a minute and asked yourself the question, how did I get here? Maybe it's an upbeat question and you're ecstatic, but maybe it's the exact opposite and you wish that you were anywhere else. No matter what, most likely each experience started with one simple question, yes or no. What is sad is how many people say no and miss out on opportunities. Oftentimes people will just tell themselves they'll go after something the next time. But what if there never is that next time? In the age of COVID, several opportunities never came back after March 11, 2020. However, I learned this lesson way before the words COVID and Zoom were in each of our vocabularies. In May of 2014, my whole perspective on life and time changed after I was diagnosed with cancer. Before I go any further, I want to be completely transparent with all of you. Cancer is a part of my past, but I've never allowed it to define me. Cancer does change your perspective on things though. I was threatened with the idea of not having time Perhaps because of COVID, you guys have also realized the importance of time. I think after the past 14 months, there's been a lot of talk about time and guarantees in college or the lack thereof. What some of us may not have realized is that COVID has taught us how to deal with adversity. Adversity comes in all forms, yet we overcome adversity each and every day. In other, lear in other words, we have learned that perseverance conquers. Joseph Campbell, an American writer from the 1900s, once wrote that, quote, opportunities to find deeper powers within ourselves comes when life seems most challenging. That quotation is talking about adversity and what we can find in ourselves. As Temple alumni, we will always say that we are Temple made and Temple proud. It means something to say that you're an owl. We are built differently. We can handle the obstacles life gives us. We won't give up or let other people define who we are. It's the same thing I learned sitting in that hospital bed years ago, and it is what all of us have learned leading up to this day. We all come from such diverse backgrounds, yet together we are all Temple Owls. We are battling through a pandemic. We have graduated like no other class. We have spent an entire year through a monitor, but we each found a deeper power in ourselves to get here. We are built to tackle any adversity that lies ahead. The next time there is an opportunity in front of you, go for it. We are resilient, tough, courageous, with a mindset that there is not always a tomorrow. Together, we can all prove to the world what it means to be a temple owl. Fellow graduates, 
Congratulations.